report, Harry and Meghan will miss the wedding of a close friend who played a crucial role in theirs. According to a story, Prince Harry and Meghan Markle did not attend their buddy Jack Mann's wedding, despite the fact that he was in their wedding party. Mann, who married Isabella Clark over the weekend at St. Peter's Church in Suffolk, England, has been tight-lipped about the guest list since the Duke's absence was brought to light. The absence of the Duke and Duchess of Sussex surprised visitors, especially since Mann, a long-standing polo friend of Harry's, participated in the Band of Brothers portrait at Windsor Castle on May 19, 2018. In Harry and Meghan's bombshell six-part Netflix documentary, a black-and-white image of the Duke with six of his closest friends at his wedding was featured in one episode. In the snap, Mann joined the group and was reportedly Harry's unofficial best man. On Harry's big day, Mann served as one of the several ushers, alongside Thomas's brother, Charlie Van Stobbensy. Those who did show up to the ceremony included Harry's friend Thomas Van Strabensey, who is godfather to Princess Charlotte, Sky News Australia reports. Thomas attended with his wife Lucy, who is a staffer at Charlotte and Prince George's former school, Thomas's Battersea. There have long been rumors in Harry's circle that there was another best man. In secret, a source told the Mail on Sunday after the release of the exiled royals' Netflix documentary, William was the best man in public, but he was not the only best man or the actual best man in Harry's eyes. It's unknown whether Harry and Mann are buddies at the moment. Years ago, they met at Sandhurst and went on to serve in Iraq and Afghanistan. Harry revealed in his autobiography Spare that he fell out with several old friends after publicly criticizing the royal family in a series of interviews and revelations. Several close mates and beloved figures in my life had chastised me for opera. He wrote in his book, How could you reveal such things? About your family. I told them that I failed to see how speaking to opera was any different from what my family and their staff had done for decades, briefing the press on the sly planting stories. The Post has reached out to reps for the Sussexes for comment.